Hi, I'm Andrew with Churnland Products, and in this edition of Authorax, we'll be talking about the Churnland RMS-160 Radon Mitigation Fan, also known as the Radon Bath. So I have a unit right here. I'm going to pull off the hood, which we'll talk about in a moment. But first, I want to talk about the main fan unit. Um, in general, this is going to have about the same effectiveness, a little more suction, a little more airflow than the typical radon mitigation fan. So for most residential size radon mitigation projects, this is going to be suitable uh, for that for that type of the type of system. Uh, the, the big advantage, though, of the RMS 160 is that it's a sidewall discharge fan. So we actually vent the, the radon gases out the sidewall. That means no ugly PVC alongside your house. It's a lot easier to install, no getting on a ladder, and there's going to be no freeze up. So if you're in a cold weather climate like we are here in our factory in Minnesota, um, when it's minus 16 outside, that moisture getting pulled up from the ground isn't going to cause blockage, a pipe to freeze up, and blockage um, in your radon mitigation system. Um, to be clear about the RMS 160 and sidewall mitigation in general, some states have kind of outdated laws from 25 years ago that don't allow contractors to vent out the sidewall. It's probably about a dozen states that require you to have PVC go up your house either on the inside or along the outside. But in any state, a homeowner in their own home can put in a sidewall mitigation system and there's no issues with code, laws, anything like that. So check with your local state whether you can have a contractor put this in or whether you'd need to put it in yourself. Um, like I said, the fan itself features really good airflow. It's got a motor outside the airstream so that it lasts a lot longer and if it burns out 10 years down the road, something like that, um, you can easily replace it just by removing that. You don't have to replace the whole fan. You can just get a replacement motor so it's a lot, uh, a lot more efficient to replace in terms of cost of replacement. It also comes with a five-year warranty, so there's no uh, concerns about buying it, having it burn down or burn out in just a few years. Um, the other main thing is that we've got these easy connections for PVC pipe rather than having to spend an extra 25, 30 bucks on PVC couplers, you can actually connect three inch PVC directly to this. You can run four inch PVC and then transition down to three to get to the fan. We've, got, we've also got a power cord for easy uh, electrical. The other main feature of this fan is the hood. And the hood is very special because um, it kind of acts as a garden hose, um, th putting a thumb over a garden hose to get extra velocity of the discharge away from your home, away from windows, doors, and be able to rain train back into the house. We minimize that by kind of pinching it down just like you would a thumb over a garden hose. So rather than having the water spew out like a garden hose and the gases spew out with just regular PVC, we put the thumb down and it sprays way out away from the home so you don't have to worry about that getting back in doors, windows, that kind of thing. It's going gonna, it's gonna to lead to the same effectiveness virtually as going above the roof. Um, and what's also nice about this is through these side ports, we actually pull in fresh air. So what comes out of here is not just the radon gas, but a mix of fresh air to instantly dilute it. And like I said, with these other, uh, the, the other fins, we're able to push them out, out from the home. And this is the episode of Back on the Racks for the Radon Vac. Thanks for listening, and we'll see you next time.